When's the last time you saw dozens of veterans in a room together? Annually at Highlands Middle School, dozens of people who served in the United States military meet together for Military Appreciation Day. It started in 1997 with just four vets. Now it's an event the whole school gets involved in, preparing the halls and welcoming home veterans from all branches and backgrounds. I spoke with retired Navy submariner Captain Ted Miller at the event about what he hopes his fellow veterans take away from this event. I hope the veterans get a sense of appreciation that, uh, that what they have done for the country, that their place in our society is appreciated, and that they can see a little bit of something in themselves in my remarks, and that, uh, and that their connection to the students both uh, enriches them and the students at the same time. Captain Miller was the keynote speaker for this year's Military Appreciation Day. His topic was, what does service mean, not always military? The event started with a social hour, then went into the assembly and ended with classroom visits and activities. I also caught up with Maya Jones, the vice president with the Highlands Middle School National Junior Honor Society, about what this event means to the veterans and how much work the NJHS team puts into it. Um, I think it meant a lot to them. We have been preparing for this for about two months now and it took a lot of work and I'm really happy with how it went. Organizer and NJHS advisor at Highlands Middle School, Connie Fow, says this event takes weeks of preparation, days of decorating to make it one of the biggest local events approaching Veterans Day. Veterans Day officially takes place next Saturday.